President Trump's recent visit to London made headlines all over the world. Royal fans were on high alert to see whether or not the controversial president would step on any toes during his trip. After all, he has a history with certain members of the royal family, his comments about how he wanted to date Princess Diana were highly publicized. However, it's his relationship or lack of with another royal that had the public on high alert. Does Meghan Markle like President Trump? Long before she married into the royal family, Meghan Markle was a successful actress with a philanthropic mindset. She frequently spoke out about certain politicians that she liked and points of view that she agreed with. She was especially vocal during the 2016 presidential election when Donald Trump ran against Hillary Clinton. It was a remarkably unique election and Markle ruffled a few feathers when she appeared on The Nightly Show with Larry Wilmore in 2016. Markle said that she sided with Hillary Clinton and believed Donald Trump to be misogynistic and divisive. She also claimed that she would move to Canada if he won the election. While Trump ultimately did win the election, Markle moved to England instead of Canada, and married Britain's most eligible bachelor, Prince Harry. When Donald Trump was recently made aware of her 2016 comments, he, of course, had a response. I didn't know she was nasty, he said, seemingly referring to the nickname of nasty woman he assigned to Hillary Clinton, and by default, her supporters. He followed that with I hope she is okay, I think she will do well. Did Meghan Markle meet with President Trump during his visit? Following his comments about Meghan Markle, many royal fans were outraged. Everyone was wondering how the visit would go, considering Markle and Trump's history of disagreements. Still, the timing might have been perfect to avoid any further scandal, Markle, who had just given birth to her son, Archie Harrison, on May 6, was still on maternity leave, and therefore exempt from any of the events planned during President Trump's visit. Her husband, Prince Harry, was obligated to attend several of the events during the visit, including a private lunch and a special state banquet. Kate Middleton and Prince William were also present as the red carpet was rolled out for Trump. While it is not known to what extent Prince Harry and Donald Trump communicated during any of the festivities, the public has certainly enjoyed speculating about whether or not Meghan Markle was a topic of conversation at the lunch. Some reports claim that Prince Harry snubbed Trump by refusing to be photographed with him, and made it a point to stay as far away from him as possible, but that certainly can't be proven. Did the royal family stand up for Meghan Markle? Meghan Markle's fans have been vocal about how inappropriate President Trump's comments were. Still, if the royal family had any reservations about the interview, they didn't let on about them in public. Queen Elizabeth has a long-held policy to always remain polite and gracious to any visitors, even those who might have a less-than-perfect history with the royal family. In the aftermath of President Trump's trip to England, some online critics have blamed Meghan Markle for not meeting with Trump, despite the fact that she is still on maternity leave. However, she will probably get another chance to cross paths with the president. There is reportedly another visit on the horizon, although not until sometime in 2020. Stay tuned for all the latest Meghan Markle news.